can't touch this. You can't touch this. Good morning, everyone. My name is Chris Hunter, and I'm a co-founder and director of Odyssey Census. Our company is built on a vision of creating low-cost technology solutions for the world's 500 million smallholder and family farmers who make 80% of the world's food. Water is a major pain point for a lot of these farmers, which is what led us to develop the product I'm going to tell you about today, Tank Sentry. We're currently launching Tank Sentry in Tasmania and have paying beta customers in the field. But before I go further into the product, let me first tell you about one of our prospective customers, farmer Bruce Ponting, who we met back in 2016. Bruce has a small free-range livestock farm in Broadford, one hour north of Melbourne. Due to the small size of his farm, Bruce does the monitoring of water points himself, which involves a daily drive around for visual inspection. Water tanks and troughs are dotted around livestock farms, and in Australia's arid climate, regular checks are absolutely essential. About a year ago, Bruce went down to Melbourne for the weekend to see his daughter. While he was away, one of his water mains broke, leaving five of his troughs without any water in them for his cattle. When he came back on Monday morning, he went out to find that, owing to a combination of dehydration and stress, there had been seven premature births, leading to very sick calves and equally struggling mothers, four dead grown cattle, and three dead calves. In addition to the very obvious animal welfare issue, this amounted to over $10,000 in losses for Bruce, as well as thousands of gallons of water he'd paid for wasted. This is just one example of why farmers are hypervigilant about checking their water points. And it is for this reason that they spend many thousands of dollars each year to have them individually inspected by farm laborers. All in all, a costly and inefficient process. But what if your tanks and troughs could text you whenever they have a problem? Now they can with Tank Sentry. All you have to do is attach you our pressure sensors to your water tanks and troughs, and the nodes will then communicate over radio to a gateway. From the cloud, we can then push alerts direct to farmers' mobile phones via a proprietary web application. Another thing that farmers really like about Tank Sentry is that it is a completely out of the box, end to end solution requiring no field engineering or technology skills whatsoever. In Tasmania alone, there are 2,000 people like Bruce. 75,000 more in Australia, and nearly 700,000 in the United States. That's what we're focused on for now, though we recognize there are many other countries, and indeed many other use cases for our technology. We've had our field coordinator, Malin, on the ground for the past year doing alpha trials, and we now have 20 beta paying customers. With a functional product, we're now moving towards full launch this quarter. Apart from our own direct sales, we have a strategic partner in AgriWeb, a leading farm data management software company based in Australia. AgriWeb wants Tank Sentry as a value add-on for its own 1,500 customers, and they say that at least three quarters of their clients have a need for our product. Once we have traction via these initial channels, we aim to hit the big ag dis distributors and retailers, of which there are more than 700 in Australia alone. Our company was originally formed by four postgraduate students on a mix of business and engineering programs at the University of Oxford, where we won the two main entrepreneurship competitions, giving us the seed funding to get started. We have since won additional investor and grant funds with which we built out our team. We have people who've run successful companies, brought IoT products to market, raised substantial amounts of funding, and have strong ties to the farming community. With the 400,000 pounds we are now seeking from our post-seed round, we aim to build out our customer support and technical functions as Tank Sentry enters an exciting new phase. While we're intently focused on its launch, we have already begun exploring how our core technology can be used in a range of other applications, such as aquaculture, e-traceability, to name but a few. We all know that the global demand for food is increasing, and the world's 500 million smallholder and family farmers are going to be crucial to meeting that demand. So we hope that you will join us on our odyssey to improve the tools at their disposal. Thank you.